Welcome back to Parasite Eve. Last time, Aya witnessed a, a tragic incident when everyone spontaneously combusted at the hands of Melissa, who went by Eve. But we learned that Eve is mitochondria Eve, the first female human who is now infecting every, li every living life form, and Aya seems to be unaffected. So we only have a few days to really you know, actually put a stop to Mitochondria Eve, so let us continue. We are officially on day two now. Let me hop on in day two. Fusion. Fusion. Hey, are you okay? You ought to be resting. I wish I could, but I'm the only one who knows what happened last night. I've been gathering some info on Melissa. She's got no relatives. And no close friends. She was sick often, always on some kind of medication. I should remember we read that in her diary. That she was always taking this medication. The people at the opera said they were amazed she could even stand on stage. Her apartment burned down right after the incident, so we have no info on her medication. What's this spontaneous combustion stuff all about? It wasn't exactly spontaneous. People were actually set on fire. Oh, come on. What? Wait. What? Like, like one of those ESP things? That's the best way to describe it for now. ESP, huh? Well... I'm not buying it. But if you're right, how are we supposed to deal with something like that? I believe her. After all, A is the only witness so far. But if you're going to take on a suspect like that, you better ask Baker for a better sidearm. You would if you're going to need some better firepower to take, take care of this parasite monster. I read your report. Still hard to believe. But we can't deny all those deaths. We aren't going to do all... We aren't going to go all out to solve this case. Make sure you're well equipped. Go down to the weapons department and give this permit to Taurus. He'll help you out. Okay, so we have a mod permit. Anything else, sir? Come back later. Sir? Did you have anything else? No? I guess not. Mind if I, like, ran ransack your room here? You don't have anything, do you, punk? He's got nothing. Oh, yes. Nice, nice music. Okay, sir. But if you're right, how are we supposed to deal with something like that? Hmm. ESP, huh? Well, I'm not buying it. I believe her. After all, A is the only witness so far. But if we're gonna... Okay. Same old stuff. Same old stuff, man. We got a save point here. Here is our... Can we look at the photo? I kind of want to look at the photo. But yeah, that's the save point there. No need to worry about that. Okay. We got some doors here. Nope, guess we can't en enter that one. Hello, ma'am. You look really tall and thin. I guess the further away you get from the camera, the thinner that they get. The weapons department? You didn't hit your head last night, did you? It's right downstairs. Ah, we will be downstairs soon enough, soon enough. I want to investigate these other, uh, other rooms first. Okay, th this is actually the way out. I do not want to leave. You sure we can't enter this? Oh, never good. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, darn it. Let's see what we got. I think it was a new vest, let's say. Okay, so we have two new vests here. We have um, high defense and strong against SA. What is SA? I don't know. I don't know what SA is. This is the other one. Light and durable armor. Okay, so this, this one actually has an ability. So this, this ability here, it is auto heal. Instantly use a medicine when you're badly injured. So that is an ability, but it's not quite as good as the, uh, this one. So I'm going to go ahead and, and e equip this one. That one's... This, I think this is the one that we got from the all alligator. Okay. Medicine 2. Hey, uh, you better put on your vet your vest too. Can't be too careful. <laughs> At last, it's mine. What's yours, sir? Sir, I want it. What are you doing in that locker? I don't. I do not like it at all. Ma'am, I will be going downstairs soon enough, so don't you worry. Okay, there's an upstairs as well, it looks like. Is there a door over here? Okay, there's a door down this way. Hmm, looks like a press conference room. Doesn't look like anything of value here. Why don't we head upstairs? Is there anything upstairs for us? Nope, looks like everything is locked off. Sorry, only authorized personnel are allowed pass pass here. I'm not authorized? That's the rule, ma'am. Sorry. Ugh. Okay, sir. I will come back when I am permitted to go through there. Okay, let's just head head downstairs to the weapons department as we are instructed to. Okay, see some doors down here. Go and investigate them. Ooh, doggies. Hello, doggies. Can I talk with you? Aw. I love to just watch them. I always come here after my shift to relax. <laughs> cool. You just relax by watching dogs. Okay. Wonderful. Wonderful news. Okay, there's a door over here, too. Authorized personnel only. Weapons department. Oh, isn't that where we're supposed to go? In the weapons area? Door there as well. Anything else? Okay, so that's pretty much it. Okay. I see some uh, treasure here. We got a tool. Okay, so I think it'll it'll mention it to us. But basically, what what the tool allows you to do? Probably get rid of some of this stuff. Increase offense plus one. Let me wait on that. Let me. Oh. Yeah, I I think we can. Let's see. This Dis discard med a medicine one. Um. The tool basically allows you to move stats from one weapon to another. So if we have, this is our more powerful weapon. Let's say, what's our most powerful one? Okay, so. If we wanted to move the stats of this weapon over, over to this one, we could technically do that. But it's only in, in the plus cat category. So we would be able to do that using a tool. Sir, I want to talk with you before I open up any more more chests. That'd be good. Hey there, good looking. Cut the crap, Wayne. Where's Torres? That badly? Who knows? So, 
What will it be? Shotgun? Rocket launcher? Wayne. Oh, I keep... Why does the dialogue keep skipping like that? I was like, I was like wondering why it was skipping like that. Idiots like you are the reason why guns won't disappear from this country. Get your A back to weapon storage. You're far from ready to be handling guns in here. Okay, okay, sheesh. Okay, sir. Torres, I need some equipment. For last night's case, heard it was quite a mess. But as long as the cops rely on guns, criminals will too. It's a vicious cycle. I hate to hand a weapon to a young cop like you. But I hear this isn't your ordinary crook. Guess I can't send you off empty-handed. Yeah, give me some powerful weapon, please, sir. That'd be very, very nice of you. Here, this is the most powerful gun I can allow you to have. Nice. Thank you. I appreciate that, sir. Okay, so the range is really, really big. Captain Baker already notified me. Show me your modification permit again. Okay. Here it is. Which gun? Okay, so this just allows you to have a, a, a different slot. It adds a slot onto the weapon that you have. I don't, I'm not going to do that right now. Come back with a modification permit if you need to tune up your equipment. Yeah, we're not going to do that just yet because there's really no, no point this, this early on. Don't tell Torres, but you can use your tool to tune up your guns. You can rearrange equipment parameters and added effects to tweak your equipment. I can show you some cool tune-up techniques. This is basically going to tell us about how to actually move, use the tool. This is a very important thing here. Using the tool item, you can add or remove parameters and added effects to your weapons or armor, creating your customized equipment. If you move an added effect from a weapon or armor, that, that equipment will disappear. The number of added effects that can be attached to a piece of equipment is determined by the number of slots on that equipment. You can increase the number of slots by getting your equipment modified and at the NYPD weapons department. So if we look at the photo here, if we, if we have a tool, we can move the plus stats from one weapon over to the other weapon. Or we can also move an ability. So the weapon on the left has a times two. It, it's barely visible. And the other one has a times three. So we could move the times three over to the times two and replace the times two with a times three shot. So we can essentially just increase the stats, increase the abilities of our weapon. But whatever weapon that we transfer it over to, it gets destroyed. So that's an interesting way of going, going about things. And, you know... You got it. Trust me, you can never have too much firepower. Of course, you can't use them without bullets, so you better make sure you always have your club. Yeah, so we can never get rid of the club. We always have a permanent club just in case we ever run out of bullets, which we very likely will, will not run out of them. Just in case, you know? Now that you... Why don't you leave the stuff we don't, you don't need with me? Okay, so this is where we can store stuff. Go and sort. Okay, we really don't need this. All right, let's, let's go ahead and move that over, over to him. We don't need the rehearsal key anymore. We don't need any of this stuff. Uh, I guess I'll move the mod permit as well. Tool, um, you know what, I will, I will keep, keep, keep the tool. And yeah, that looks, looks good, okay. We also put some equipment in here, so let's sort that as well. But by attack. So this is our more powerful weapon that we just got. I have not e equipped it yet. Let me do do that. We can kind of see what the tool is in action. This is going to increase our attack almost like double it. Double our, our range. And pretty much more than double the amount of bullets that, that it can shoot out. So this is basically a... A rifle. So you can use it from a far distance, but it is much slower. So we can 
This one has, uh, and what's nice is that this one has triple, triple shots. So it has, actually, it only has two there. So we can actually, if we were to move the three over, it could attack three times. So that's, uh, really, 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 really nice. We can do that. Um, if we look at the plus stats, it says plus one, plus two, plus one. The one that we had was plus three, plus two, plus one. So what we could do, go ahead and use our tool. We can do a variety of different things here. Tune up weapon and armor. There we go. So here's our current weapon that we that we have. And we have one tool and we have zero super tools. So the super tool actually allows you to move stuff without losing your weapon. But we don't have any of those yet. So here is our weapon here. And the other one that we want to use is this one here. Basically what we want to do now is we want to... Take the plus stats of here, plus three, plus two, plus one, and move it over to the o o over to our rifle. So then it'll be plus four, plus four, and plus two. We wait a minute. Let's say perimeter will be moved. Okay. So this is what we want to do. We want to move this one over. Yes. And like so. Now we have plus four, plus four, plus two on on this one. So we have a massive range. Really good attack. And with a good, good bullets as well. We can have about seven, seven, 17 bullets in that. Okay. Wonderful. So now, sir, I would like to store... You want to leave something here? Yes, I do. I would like to store... Actually, I do not want to reload that, but... Move that over. I uh, can't move the club. As you can see. Uh, the a vest with the auto heal ability. I'll keep that in there. We can use that later. Normal armor. Put that in there, and that looks good. So our inventory has been cleared up quite a bit. That's right, we also have some bonus points we can distribute as well. We can increase some um, storage items. We have we can in increase our, our attack. We can increase our defense stuff. So mostly what, what you want to do is you want to Put, put your bonus points towards your actual we weapon attack. That tends to be the best thing you can do. I mean, you can put it towards a variety of other things. So, And there's, uh, there's actually one other option here as well. Discard junk. We, we will see what that does very, very soon. But you have any equipment? You mod uh, no, I don't want to modify anything. Thank you so very much. Ammo plus six. Thank you, sir. Medicines. Okay. Okay, so I'm just going to wait to increase my uh, attack weapon and all that other stuff. Okay, let's let's head back up to our to our chief guy. Let's see what he has to say now that we have a more power, much more powerful weapon. Sure. Oh, wait. Actually, wait, where, where is the chief guy? I do want to talk, talk to the chief. Will he be okay? Actually, should I, should I talk to that kid first? Yeah, I, I don't know if that's a kid or a person. Let me, let me go talk, talk to that person first over there. Okay. Looks like some sort of kid over here. Oh, yep, yeah, you are a kid. Hello, kid. Hey there. You lost? Ah. Ben? Ben? Daddy. I told you to stop snooping around this police station. So this is Ben. Ben, this is Aya. Now, what are you doing here? Here. Tickets? Oh yeah, the concert. Sorry son, daddy's real busy today. I promise I'll make up for him. Fine! Ben. Poor kid. You just gonna, gonna leave. Guess every kid need, needs a mother. That's not true. I was raised by my father too, after my mother died. I'll always be grateful for him. Yeah, well, his mother's still alive. Hmm. 
Ma'am, you were not here just a moment ago. You realize that, right? Okay. Let's go see the chief man. Sir. You are looking for me? Yes. We have a press conference now, and I want you there, too. Me? That's right. You'll be on national television as the sole survivor of that incident. I see. But you only answer when I asked you. The media is just looking for anything to grill us about. They may even turn you into a suspect, so you let me do the talking. Understood? Yes, sir. Okay, then. Let's go meet the press. Oh, great. Here we go. Here comes the fake news, right? We're going to meet, meet the fake news. We're going twi to twist our story. So you are saying this could be the work of a terrorist? This is what we currently speculate. How about accounts of officers and, and firemen at the scene bursting into flames? Yeah, this is, see, this is, he's lying. The, the, uh, the police officer, I mean, the chief is, is lying here. Like, like, dude, I guess you can't necessarily reveal everything, but still. That was, oh, oh, darn it, hang on. I created a safe state right before that. Because I am afraid that I'm going to, it's going to skip stuff. That was, that was due to a rare... Highly flammable chemical, which was used to start the fire. Another question. Then how did Detective Brea survive without so much as a minor burn? That is a result of her quick thinking and training as an officer. I'm asking her the question. She... I think she can answer for herself. She said that my mitochondria were a mutation. They, and then you answer correctly and they're like, what the heck are you talking about, Aya? Aya, please don't talk about mitochondria. No one knows what that is. Your mitochondria? Who said this? That's right, Aya, just lay it down all on the line, just Say it all. Melissa. No, she said she was Eve. But according to a report, Melissa Perch was killed in the fire. Melissa did die. Her body had been taken over by this Eve. What's this Eve? Some sort of... some kind of alien? People, please! She is very tired and we are still investigating. That will be all for today. Mm, so some of the truth got out there, some information got out, but not quite every, everything that, that we needed. Hey, yeah, I thought I told you not to say anything. I'm telling the truth, sir. Gosh darn it, this is not the point. Who's going to believe you? You, you, you only stir up the media and cause people to panic. Sir, she was only... Hello, I'm, I'm not, I, I didn't even pick up the phone. The phone's still sitting there, but anyway. Baker here, who? What, what does he want? Well, put him through then. I'm just holding up my hand, you know, pretending I'm answering the phone, but I'm really not, but okay. This is Captain Baker. What, me? You have to speak up. Yes, what? Yes, all right. Some Japanese scientist, I think, couldn't understand his English too well. He was raving about some Mito something. Said he's coming over here. Mito. Is it mitochondria? You mean that thing in the cell that makes energy from oxygen? Might have heard about that in school. That's what Eve had said. That isn't the, the time. That isn't. That isn't time for the mitochondria to be set free. 
Yep, it is time for the mitochondria to be set free. Hey, I just read that some researcher at the museum wrote a new theory on them. Sir, I'm taking Aya to go talk with this researcher. Go. Better get there before the media. It may explain that phone call, too. Okay, so we gotta go meet a scientist now. Yes, sir. Come on, Aya. Alright, let's go find the scientist. Okay, sir. Are, are, are we ready to go see, see the scientist? I'll bring the car around. Meet me at front. Okay. That's it there. I didn't talk to this 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 guy at all, sir. Do you have anything to say? Can I not talk talk with you, sir? There we go. Okay, good. What a case to have on Christmas, huh? Is that all is that all you had to say, sir? Okay, you know, you're dumb. You're dumb. Okay, so here we are here out on the map selection screen. We can go back to Carnegie Hall. We were just at the NYPD, but now we're gonna head to the museum. The one we head on over there. We're going to the Museum of Natural History. Dr. Hans Clampum will be there. Dr. Clamp? What's his area of research? Well, according to the papers, he's working on a new theory. Mitochondria or something. But it seems to cover the whole genetic spectrum. That's odd. You have a PhD in me working in a museum. Well, he's pretty antisocial and doesn't like to waste time outside research. Oh, great. We're going to have a grand time with this one. Yeah, yeah. I know there. I know where you're going to go with this. Just be careful this time, huh? You're referring to the press conference. Yeah. Then you know, why do you kiss the chief's butt? You two joined the force at the same time, didn't you? Yeah, but that was years ago. Now he's my boss. That's true, you gotta listen to your boss or you risk being hired. Such a shame, right? Okay. American Museum of Natural History. And we have, what is that on, on front there? Chocobo? Is that what that said? Take a look again. Chocobo, yep. I believe that's something from Final Fantasy, which makes sense because this is by the same developers as Final Fantasy, so there you go. It's been a while since I've visited the museum. Yeah, it looks all like rusty and run down and everything. Dinosaur exhibit. Loved these things when I was a kid. Hmm. Looks like it's closed today. Well, let's see what the security guard can do for us. Yeah, let's see what that security guard can do. He's gonna let you in. Very likely. Okay. Security guard, can you let us in, please? Hey there. How you doing? Doing okay. Pretty cool day, though. How about yourself? That's not the face that matches that voice, but, you know, it don't matter. We're with the NYPD. We're looking for Dr. Clamp. He works here, doesn't he? Sure does. As a matter of fact, he's up there in his room right now. Did he do something? Damn, I'm sorry. Did he do something? Nah, we just want to talk to him. That's all. Thank you. It shouldn't take long. Okay, let's head on in and find this doctor. Place is, place is pretty creepy. Uh, you'll find him in the research lab on the second floor. Uh, somehow, Sometimes the, the uh, dialogue advances on its own. Other times it doesn't. 
Okay. He's been pretty busy for the past few weeks. Doesn't come out ever. I wonder if I don't if I don't hit anything. Will it advance it or not? See, I mean, that's the thing that I don't like. Like so, some of the dialogue advances, others it doesn't. It's like, okay, thanks. That's um interesting. It should at least all do that or or not at all. Okay. I'm going to go over here and investigate. I'm going to actually say first. Oh, by the way, you could sign in. It's policy. Let us keep track of who comes in. Oh, this... Thanks, Aya. Uh, gee, Daniel, you sure don't want to run down here and do it yourself? Notebooks on the counter, thanks. Oh, it's for contract tracing, isn't it? That's what it is. You have to know everyone who's been here. Just my name? Yep. That should be enough, unless you want to leave your number too, so we can contact trace you. Uh, I'll put my number in too. Just in case. Now let me, let me save, yes. Okay. Right, let's go find this researcher. Hopefully, there'll be he will have some important information about the mitochondria for us. You have anything else to say, sir? Hey, just between us, the doctor's a bit, you know. Just be careful. Uh oh, is he a creep? Is he a total loony loony bin? Hey, hey, yeah. Over here. Hey, it's open. Let's check the check it out. Okay. Hopefully the doctor's in here so we can talk to him. Excuse me. Hello? Hey. Oh gosh, his screen is flickering. Dr. Clamp! Going to get a seizure, man. What are you doing? That computer. Dr. Clamp! Ah, here you are. Just one more pornographic image. We're with the NYPD. We'd look to ask you a few questions. Professor, we're looking for clues concerning the incident which occurred. Are you accusing me? What? This again? What is this? Okay, so she's having another flashback. She's remembering something. Maybe that's the doctor. This man. This is the man, maybe, who experimented. I, I know him, I think. Very possible. What's wrong? Are you okay, Aya? Yeah. I would like to ask you about the mitochondria research you've been doing. He's looking up mitochondria porn, isn't he? Yeah, that's what he's doing. And my PD, huh? What are you interested in my work? The suspect mentioned that the mitochondria will be set free. Now, do you... That suspect ignited people without laying a finger on them. Then it transformed into some kind of creature and ran off. Then she mentioned mitochondria. We were hoping you could supply us with some info. Uh -huh. You two have absolutely no idea what the true mitochondria is like. Do you? The mitochondria possesses its own unique genetic code. Its own? Are you saying it's separate... It's a separate organism? Precisely. Kind of like a parasite or something, huh? Parasite? That's an interesting way to describe this most fascinating creature. We cannot live without the mitochondria. Do you understand? The mitochondria creates energy for us. Without it, we're nothing. We are here because the mitochondria allows us to be here. 
our brain, for example. The brain functions due to the interaction between axons and dendrites. dendrites. The interaction is possible due to the energy the mitochondria provides. Do you know that the mitochondria is capable of discharging 200,000 volts of electricity? This not only pertains to electri electrical discharge, but also applies to heat energy as well. Heat? Then the combustion from last night were... For a human to burn and melt, 1600 degrees of heat must be generated. There are several hundred mitochondria present within a single cell. If all the mitochondria in the body began functioning at the same time, a tremendous amount of energy will be generated and released. Melting a human into a puddle of fluid would be a very simple task with so much energy. So you're saying that the mitochondria ignited these people? Professor, you may be right in that we need the mitochondria to live. But in the end, we're just using them for energy, right? Haha, <laughs> you have no idea. The mitochondria has control over an organism's growth. Take this hand, for example. Before we're born, this hand is merely a glob of flesh. But when cells between the fingers deteriorate, that's when the fingers first form. When the cells which make up the body aren't needed anymore, it receives a signal to die. The signal is ignited by the mitochondria. When it is relayed, the genetic information in the nucleus is cut off and in a sense, and in, in essence, dies. The same can be said for aging. The mitochondria mutates 10 times faster than cells. Of course, this also applies to mutant forms of mitochondria as well. When too many mutant mitochondria multiply, energy production level decreases. The decrease in energy production is associated with the aging process. So, are you still stupid enough to say that we are the higher species? But you're not saying that the mitochondria is, going, is doing all this consciously, right? When I say that the mitochondria can mutate 10 times faster than normal cells, I also meant that they can evolve at a rate 10 times faster. Since the beginning of creation, the mitochondria has been evolving at this rate. It's no surprise if they possess a power beyond our cognition. No surprise at all. Let me tell you something. There was a scientist who tried to determine the mutation rate of the mitochondria. With this, the scientist wanted to establish a connection with human ancestry. In 1987, it was announced that the root of all humans can be traced to a single woman in Africa. This finding was announced around the world. And with this, the mitochondrial theory spread like wildfire. You know what they call the root of it all? Mitochondria Eve. Splendid name. Just incredible. Eve? The suspect in yesterday's case called herself Eve. What? Hey, if you know anything, you better not be holding back on us. She called herself Eve. Sorry, but I've told you what I know. I'd like to return to my studies now. I believe you know the way out. Hey, you better explain what the hell's going on here. I'm gonna look up my mitochondria porn now. Daniel, forget it. Let's just go. Gosh darn it. Wow. Okay, let's head back to the NYPD. What the hell is wrong with that guy? I can't stand him. 
how fast this guy's driving. I mean, like, everything's like a blur, like, around him. Like, what, what the heck, man? That man. I've seen him before, but I can't remember where. See, I think the picture's starting to come, come together now. It's Daniel. What? Okay, we'll be right there. Hey, yeah, looks like we got a break in the case. What? We gotta get back to the station, Aya. Hey, uh, hold on, I'm kicking this into turbo. You're already in turbo, man! You wanna go even faster? My gosh, she's already going like 200 miles an hour. We just wanna go 500? Going to speed of light? He should be there. He should be there already. Okay, here you are. New York City Police Department, 17th Precinct. Okay, let's go follow him. Where did you go, sir? Where did you go? I see up here. Let's go, folks. We're... Dude, that was way, way too fast. Let's go, folks. We're starting the meeting. Okay. Is this the me meeting, meeting room? Let's head in. Melissa's solo concert was scheduled for today. She had disappeared after last night's incident and the concert was cancelled. People are still gathering at the stage. We must not let another massacre happen again. The concert is at the Central Park Amp Amphitheater. Central Park? What is it, Daniel? Ben and Lorraine, they're at the concert. What? Oh, gosh darn it. Daniel, screw you, Baker. My son's in danger. They didn't even get a chance to see what Baker even said. Daniel. Oh, yeah. Watch his back. Yes, sir. Oh, got another mod permit. Thank you, sir. Okay. Guess we gotta head to Central Park now. Sir, before I go there, I want to go deposit this mod permit. I do not want to hold on to it. Not right now. Let me just get rid of it. What are you going to do? Let me tune up the guns? When are you going to let me t let me tune up the guns? I didn't ask to be assigned here to watch over the warehouse all day, you know? As long as you see guns as, as toys, you never touch them. Hey, I know. I can make a stronger gun than you. Guns aren't supposed to be stronger, you numbskull. They're supposed to be safer. Fine, you geezer. Thank you, sir. Oh, this... More ammo, thank you. This, uh, this one replenishes too, looks like. More medicine. Man, so much better. I can turn guns into a cannon, easily. You wanna leave something here? Yes, I do. I wanna store... I would like to store another mod permit. Thank you so very much. And I think that is good for now. Okay, let's go ahead to Central Park. Stupid Daniel's family, that is. Oh. Let's go.
What the hell does Melissa or no, Eve want from us? Well, it looks like she wants to gather people in one big area. Damn, well, that's got my boy involved. She's going to pay for this. Let's hurry. Just hang in there, Ben. I'm coming for you. Yeah, you don't care about, about your wife, right? The wife don't matter. Okay, Central Park. Let's head on in. Ben! Daniel, stop. Oh, I got to get my boy, Rookie. Oh, whoa. I think your son's already dead. <laughs> Just my guess. Sometimes you got to look before you leap, old timer. I don't care if I burn. I'll go. Ben's my son. He's the only family I've got. Damn, I can't do anything. Leave it to me. Well, but... But... I'll get them out safe, I promise. Besides, Ben needs you. We won't do him any good if you are dead. Alright, I'm counting on you, Aya. I know. We shall not let you down, sir. Not at all. Aya, Ben's... Don't worry, I'll find him. I won't come back until I do. Okay. What if we just, like, hijack his, like, police car? And just leave. Okay. Here we are, finally heading into Central Park. So now, let's do the things that we need, need to do here. Let's, uh... Use our items. We have offense plus one to increase our weapon attack. There we go. We have defense plus one for our armor. And let's see what else do we have. We can distribute bonus points. Okay, so yeah, th this, is, this is the full thing. So you can increase your active time, like how quickly like your, your AT meter fills up. Increase your item capacity. Honestly, those are pretty much... Point, pointless. They are, are, really are. There's really no, no point. So I guess you could actually use the bonus points with Wayne there to increase some of his stuff or something. Like, I, I, I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, you can increase like your defense, your your PE energy, your critical. I'm mostly going to focus on on the actual attack to increase. So you just select the weapon. You can select one of one of the three things, and I'm going to select the attack. So from plus five to Plus six, so it's going to increase our attack to 40 for that weapon, so... Yeah, that is going to be great, isn't it? It really is. Okay. Here we are in Central Park now. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and save. Good, good, good. All right, so any enemies that that we see should be taken care of preti easily. Is there any? There you go. There, there's a chest hidden behind there. Cure poison. We don't really need it. Yeah, I think there's another chest here, it looks like. Oh snakes, Colonel! It's me. I have investig. I have found this this late loser here. So as you can see, the oh gosh, please. The range of the rifle is massive, and it's really slow though. That's that's like the problem. But it is very very powerful. It really is. Okay, we got some uh, ammo and some me medicine. I'll take all that. Thank you. Okay, let me get get the chest here. So hard to actually see see them. It really is. Blends in so well. Medicine one. Uh, let's make sure my items are 
That's 16 spaces. I need more. I need plenty more more space. Okay. This is also like impossible to see also. I mean, there, there's like a chest a chest there. Oh, now we're heading into the zoo area. The zoo is always nice, isn't it? I mean, we're gonna see like a bunch of like creepy things. Okay. Let me increase my brightness. Maybe I'll be able to see it a little better. There we go. I don't, I don't know if I, if I will, but got some more ammo. We got your creepy monsters here, isn't it? Creepy, creepy monsters indeed. Okay, the M9. Very, very low low attack. But it has tri triple shot, so... Eh, not something I'm going to really focus on. Okay, another battle here. Let's see what we got. Some birds. Oh gosh. Ah! Stupid birds. Got him. And we got some junk from them. So if you if you remember back within a Wayne, he could discard junk. If you discard a lot of junk, he, there's actually something special you can you can get. Not that I'm gonna necessarily go for that, but um, yeah, you can discard a lot of junk and get some nice stuff. Another telephone to save. If we so desire. Eve was here. <laughs> Eve was here, yes. Eve was indeed here. Oh, the SP vest. Okay, move, move that aside. You need a key. I believe that there is like a key here, right? Hmm. I don't have a key though. Anything else? Hmm. I could have sworn that there was a key that we could actually pick up there, unless it's inside of there. Okay. Head over here. Another battle. I don't know what you are, sir, but you do not look very friendly at all. I do not like li uh, like that one bit. Looks like he's quite durable. Oh gosh, please. Are you like a monkey man? Kinda looks like a monkey man. Okay. Gotta level up. Very, very nice. Okay, we got some chests here, it looks like. Got a tool. Let's see what else. The chest here, it looks like, too. 
Ooh, Emma plus 15. That's always good. Okay, sir. Ah, oh, gosh. That guy's a creep. Let that take take care of the bird first. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, he actually hit me that time. Oh nice, we actually got a critical on him and it did a lot of damage. Also picking up a lot of junk. Okay. Use some of this medicine. Discard some other ones. There you go. Clear, clear up some of our inventory, at, at least. Okay. Have we been in here? We have not. Okay. Need need a key. Okay, we, we don't have that key yet, unfortunately. Oh gosh, there's two of you guys now. Okay. Oh gosh, okay. Okay. You guys kind of suck. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Stay away, man. Gosh, he has such massive range on that. It is insane. Okay, so now we have learned detox, so it allows us to get um, rid of uh, poison if we ever get that. Okay, so let's head back into this room over here now that had that locked drawer thing. Okay. I guess it can be very bit finicky. So apparently the he is in a drawer. There we go. Zuki, got it. So honestly, that that was that was quite annoying. That it was kind of like right there. But anyway, is this? It looks like this is a machine gun, and it has a special ability. So let's see what this ability is. This ability is heat. Your shots would do heat damage. Oh, it's a grenade launcher. Okay, it, I'm just looking at at the image there. So a grenade launcher, huh? That sounds interesting. Um, it's not really powerful. We have 40, and then we have we have the M9 as well. That's really weak. Yeah, it, it's just too weak to even bother to use. But it, I kind of want to see it in action. But eh. You know what, I'm gonna equip it just to see it in action, like, once. Okay, we should be able to open up this door now. Now that we have the key. There we go. Oh, okay. Let's try out our, our grenade launcher against these snakes. Oh no, it's me. I have... I'm going to poison this lay loser. Very weak. <laughs> yeah, this was uh, not a good weapon to equip, but not in this like tight, confined area. Gosh, these snakes are so fast. Oh my gosh. But they're not poisoning us, which is which is which is good. They're not dead though.
my gosh, this was a terrible idea. Okay, you know what? We need to use some... Can I change it? Yeah, I can, I can change it mid-battle, mid yes. Adds heat effect to the bullets, okay. Give something that's actually good. Good, 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 good. Okay, great. Get rid of this darn snake. Colonel, I have almost killed her. Oh no, Colonel, she has killed me really, really quickly. Okay, let's, let's actually use those me medicines pronto. Oh, I use medicine too. Oh well. That was a mistake. That that was that, that was an oopsie on my part. There are so many types of rainforest snakes. Some are poisonous, but most aren't. Okay. The giant worms of South America are very important to the rainforest ecosystem. Interesting. Okay, well this glass is broken here. So we can get behind the exhibit. Get some chests. Your poison, which we don't need. Fence plus one. I will take that and I will use that. Wait, what's the one that we have equipped? It usually shows it. The KV fest. Okay. No, the other one is more, more, more powerful. Lightly. SP vest. Okay. Let's say they both have. Yeah, SP vest it is. Great, great, great. Okay, and then. You know, I can get rid of these poison as well. I really don't need, need them. Great. Wonderful. We have four items, item spots clear. Now let's continue on. Okay, I think we got all the enemy, uh, all the items here. Ah, oh, three birds, huh? Oh crap! Wow, one one hit kill for uh, for the bird. There we go. That was an effective use of uh, stuff there. Okay, great. We got some more bonus points. We got a bunch of junk. I should not even be picking up the junk. Because I doubt I'm going to really do much of anything with it. Anyway, it's time to distribute some bonus points as well. Let's uh, increase our... Yeah, let's increase our weapon again. Very good. And let me get, get rid of some of this junk. Guard the junk. Get rid of this crap. We don't want it. We don't need it. We don't want it. It's disgusting. It's nasty. Okay, let's head over here. Oh, how 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 pretty this this scenery is. Oh, what are you? I do not like you at all. Good, good, good. These weird te tentacle monsters. Okay, she had to reload, unfortunately. 
<laughs> nice. Very, very good. Okay, yes. Give me all that ammo. Okay. I want to make sure that I get an item here, just to be safe. Okay, looks like I already got the item there. Okay. Alright, let's continue up here now. Can we not go up there? Okay. Let me just up, up this way. It looks like there's like a path like right here. Is there a path there? I can't quite tell. Mm, is there? Right here? Yeah, there it is. Okay. It looked like there was, but I wasn't entirely sure. More snakes, huh? Okay, I think these are the ones that poison you, so let's, let's be very, very caref careful. And we are poisoned, so let's, let's use D Atox. Okay. Get rid of our poison condition. Good. Good. Darn sucky snakes. Okay, what do we have here? Medicine 2. That's okay. Another chest over this way. Ammo plus 15. Okay, let's, let's get rid of some of our crap now. Okay, so let's use our medicine, junk, discard. Okay. We good. We good. Okay, there's nothing up there, it looks like. Let's head down here. Oh, snake. Colonel, it is me. I am, I am now po uh, poisonous. There you go. Get rid of the snake pronto. Oh, stupid birds. In my way. Oh, I... If, if we do some more damage, we can actually kill him in like one, one hit, which is a great. There go, level up again. Now we, now we learn heal too. So now we have the ability to actually heal ourselves even more. Very, very nice. Max HP increases, all of our other stuff increases, and our item capacity increases. Good. We definitely need as much item capacity as we possibly can. Especially early on, you know, you just need just... How much do we have? 20 items now? Yes. All of the enemies, ha all the animals have escaped. Oh, those darn animal right activists. Always letting out the animals. There's like a dead, dead body over here. Nothing? Not gonna say anything about the dead, dead body? Okay. Head up. Hmm. Head on in. It's like some sort of theater now. This is where... I guess the performance is taking place, I see. There she is. The holiday season brings joy to us all.
and this Christmas will be the most special of all. Ah, uh, uh. Special because I will no longer be under the control of a host. As I have since the dawn of time. Humans, a weak mitochondria, can self-evolve. Mitochondria must now take over the nucleus. My goodness. Eve. We were too late. She has melted. Everyone in the audience, you can see their bone. Forming a gigantic mass. Well, sorry, but Daniel, I think, uh, damn Daniel, I think your, uh, your kid is, uh, dead. Sorry. Sorry. I have to get backstage and stop her. She, she, look, she already did it, okay? She already did it, everyone's dead. Hmm. Oh, little girl. Come back here, little girl. Oh. Of course, conveniently marked sign backstage. There she is. Why? Why are you doing this? You again. But you are too late. Hey, yeah, look, everyone's just a gigantic blob. You were too, too late, I guess. Sorry. You will not ruin my plans as you did last night. Stop. Darn her. She has left. And she went over here with this dead body was that we could not proceed. Well, now, conveniently, we can actually go across. Go figure, right? Hmm. Okay. What do we have up here? I saw a chest. Don't fool me, game. I saw a chest. Oh, we got battle up here and a safe point as well, it looks like. Oh, a gigantic bear, huh? That does not look look good at all. Oh crap oh no. Oh snap. Bear that can shoot le uh, like electricity? What in the world was that? Let's go ahead and save. That was insane. It looks like we have a door over here as well. Does this go anywhere? No, it doesn't. It's just for a stupid safe point over here. And then a chest that I... You can't see when you get up on it. Okay, where is this chest? For real. That, that is just... I see it. In the back left corner here. Back in here. There it is. Got this creepy music playing too. Oh, 
There's the little girl. We gotta go follow her. Where you going, girl? Hmm. Well, there she is. We're not going to follow her over there. We're actually going to defy her. We're going to go over over here. I like how there's just like these conveniently like paved, I guess, walking ways in, 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 in Central Park. You know, how convenient. Okay, here's an item up, up here. More ammo. Great. Another chest here, looks like. Ooh, the SV vest. And we have... It looks like it's like an inventory plus one. Let's see what that is. Item capacity up. Increases your item capacity by one, two, or four slots. So that is plus, plus one. That's pretty good. So let's see if it's any more powerful than, than what we have. We can also use a tool to uh, move it over. Okay, 19. What is that? Ah, the base stats are not as good. The Yeah. That we could technically move over the ability, but that's really not a not a necessarily a good ability. It's like it's like an okay ability, but uh. Uh, okay. More enemies here? Oh, another bear, huh? Oh, and a bird. Oh gosh. Give it to the bird first. Oh, thank you, bear. He just like conveniently like is just gonna just turn the other way. Sorry, bear. I had to reload. Hopefully, you're not mad. There you go. The bear is like easy because he like he like moves too slow. Okay, moving on. Oh, some more enemies, huh? I want to get another level up. I love the levels up. Oh gosh, a snake. Colonel, it's me. Yes. <laughs> you can't, you can't see a snake and and not say Colonel, it's me, snake. Okay, let's get rid of some junk, I guess. Use our medicine. Actually, I can get rid of the, the poison. Let me actually sort this. Okay, get, get rid of poison. Get rid of some junk. There we go. We have... That's an okay amount, I'd say. Okay, this can... Continue on. Oh, defense plus one, huh? May as well. Okay. This is where you can see all all the all the main stats. So twenty one. It's not that that bad, but yeah, there we go. Increase our defense even more. A little girl, we're not gonna follow her again. There's another item for us to pick up here. Oh, another tool. Can't have too many of those. We would definitely save those for something that is valuable. That we can move over the appropriate stats and abilities. Okay.
There's gonna be another enemy is in there here. Yep, just as I thought. Oh, a ton of birds. Oh my gosh. Turn you birds. Okay, two of them are out. They, they just move so fast. They don't do too much damage, but still. They're just annoying. You're gonna give me a bunch of junk, aren't you? That's all you're worth, birds. Just a bunch of junk. That's all you gave me, junk. I'm not gonna be grinding all this junk for, for the super special thing that you can get from from Wayne unless there's like a cheat code there may be a cheat code like unlimited junk or something I'll use that but I'm not gonna just waste my time doing all the junk like nah you know I'd rather not let me check my item 19 <laughs> of course where's my health at can't even see your health oh, I guess 107 um, okay. That's really not, not worth it doing that. I'll get rid of some junk. I wanted to keep a little bit of junk. Good to keep a little bit of junk on you, you know? Oh gosh, two snakes. Yes, Colonel. It is I. Snake. Oh gosh. Careful, careful, careful. Oh, gosh. Okay, good. Okay, good. The poisonous snakes are, are out of here. I just gotta deal with this electricity bear. Oh, thank you, bear, for allowing me to reload. He's so kind. He, he, he allows you to re reload. Okay, good. We gotta level up. What we got here? We got some more bonus points. Increase our item capacity even more. Tons of ammo. It's such a satisfying feeling when you actually level up, you know? Let's go ahead and use these bonus points up. Yeah, just in keep increasing my, uh... Weapon attack. Yeah. Little bit at a time. Little bit, every little bit counts. Do a little bit more damage here and there. Okay. Oh, you you guys should be t uh, taken care of much much easier now. Oh gosh. I think it took more than two hits before. Well, like that. That guy. I guess we got critical on, on one of the other ones. Good. You did, man. You did. You had tons of tons of ammo. We're gonna be like maxed out on, on ammo or something. Just like so much ammo. Okay, it's some chests here. Ooh. Ooh. Both of those things sound very, very nice. Defense plus one. Yes, I will use that. And I'm pretty sure when you move over the stats... It, yeah, we, we, we did it. It moved over all, all the plus stats. You don't just pick and choose one. It moves them all over. So, if ever we need to move it... Okay, increases critical evasion by one. That's good. Okay, moving on now. We gotta, we gotta be getting close to Eve soon, right? How far could she have possibly have gone? items
Oh, there's a safe point, which means we're probably close. We're probably close to something. Oh gosh, the turtle man. I'm gonna take care of the birds first, I think. Good. Oh! You farted out disgusting gas, man! That was disgusting. Is that nasty gas that that guy farted out? Oh my gosh, it was f it's like green. Like, dude, what what have you eaten? What have you eaten, man? Okay. Get rid of some more junk. See, if we were actually took all this junk back to uh to Wayne, he would be so happy. He really would be like, oh nice. Thank you for all this amazing junk. I love junk. He can make good good use of, out of it. Okay. Let us continue on. Oh gosh, another enemy. Oh, this one's a boss. I can tell by the music changing. Oh gosh. It's worms. Darn it. Wasted ammo. Okay. Okay, let's just wait. There we go. Nice amount of damage. Weird, weird boss, but okay. Careful, careful, careful now. Okay, we we have to heal. We have to heal. I'm actually going, going to use medicine too. There we go. Hold on, hold on. Oh gosh, did you did, did you get bigger, sir? I think this fool got got bigger. He had to have. Oh gosh, this is getting tricky now. I better heal again. Heal too. I need to, I need to be very careful about avoiding those spike things that come out. It's hard. It's very very hard. Oh gosh, we gotta heal again, don't don't we? Take it easy. Oh. Okay, another one dead. I better heal again. You know, I'll, I'm gonna use my item this time. Oh gosh, you keep getting bigger, man. He keeps getting bigger. That ain't cool. Like the dad daddy worm here now. Okay. Sir, I don't have any time for you. I gotta heal first. Just one 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 guy left, it looks like. We're gonna come up from dude, okay. Doing so much damage. Oh crap. If I heal again, I'm gonna heal heal again. Oh. 
Okay, wait for him to come back out and we should be good. Yes! Okay, four items. Oh, and we gotta level up. A lot of bonus points. We learned barrier. Oh my gosh. Tons of bonus points. Oh crap. We can do, we can do, yeah, nice. Defense plus, we got two things of ammo and two things of defense plus one. Good. That was honestly worth it. That was definitely worth it for sure. Okay, let's go ahead and use use these on our on our vest. And we're pumping every everything into. Uh, and then we got a bunch of bonus points to distribute. Increase our attack. We can increase it three more. To 45 now. Amazing. Okay, let's continue on. Oh no. There you go. She there she is. Your genes are stronger than I thought. Come, my dear. Let's go for a ride. <laughs> what if I don't wanna? But I guess I I I guess we have to. I shall join you for this ride, ma'am. I just need some answers. Why? Why be on the human side? Why not? I'm a human. Why are you going with them and not me? What? Okay, another boss boss battle. In this very tight corridor. Ma'am, I don't got time. I gotta heal, sorry. Ah! You suck. Okay, if that's the game you want to play. Oh, don't ever right, right into that one. Okay, good. You know what, I'm gonna heal again just in case. Can't ever be too careful. Oh, she's dead. <laughs> I didn't even have to heal. It seems you still don't know who I am. Well, if you don't know, your mitochondria will. That's why you were drawn to this opera. What are you talking about? Here, let me explain directly. Stop it. Yep, don't touch me with your dirty, na nasty hand. Look how dirty and nasty that is. If we join forces, if forces, all the other mitochondria in the world will stop.
Aya. Aya, answer me. Daddy. Oh, he's still alive. Oh, thank goodness. Daddy. Ben. Weren't you going to the concert? It's like, are you not happy to see him? Shouldn't you say, oh my gosh, son. So happy that, you, that you're alive. Like, like, hey, weren't you going to the concert? I came here with mom, but sh she was all weird. Yeah, she, she, she melted. What do you mean, Ben? Came here with mom so the three of us could be together. So that's why you came to get me? Mom once went to the stage, but she freaked out. What do you mean, Mom freaked out? Yeah, she kind of like turned into like a blob. I got near the stage and started to feel sick. I wanted to go home. Mom wasn't herself, Dad. She left and everyone else went too. The rain. Oh! <laughs> Casualties were much worse this time. We cannot put the lives of citizens in, je in jeopardy any longer. We have orders to evacuate all citizens out of Manhattan. Fortunately, most people are out of the city for Christmas. What do we do, sir? We will stay and assist in neutralizing Eve. Shouldn't we leave it to the army? We're the ones that are supposed to be protecting the city. Any word from Aya? Damn it. Where could she be? Daniel, I need you to help evacuate the citizens. She's our only hope against this thing now. I'm going to go look for her. Shouldn't we stop him, sir? He's lost Lorraine. Oh! He'll find Aya. You two help with the evacuation. Daddy. Ben, I'm sorry. I have to go find Aya. Where'd she go? I don't know, but she's the only one that can fight this thing that hurt your mommy. Kath, look after the kid, will ya? I will, don't worry. Daddy. Dad's always leaving. Come on, sport. You like dogs? That's the introduction to the best place dogs in town. Dogs that'll bite bite your your arms off if you uh act up. Can I show this boy the dog? Sure. Let me open the fence. Oh no 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 no. Hey, you got a visitor. This is Shiva. Hey, Shiva. <laughs> hey, I think she likes you. Hey, 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 that tickles. Yeah, wait until she bites but your head right off. It, that'll really tickle, won't it? Looks like everyone's evacuating. How many times do I gotta tell ya? We've blocked this off. You won't even find a cat on this street. Oh, he's just, he, look, he's just looking for, for a cat now, you know? It's, that's all he wants. Uh, I've told you, I've already contacted the police about this matter. Uh, what? It, um, it, it's not getting anywhere with my English. I'm not getting anywhere with my English. That's right, yeah, because this is the guy who was supposed to come to the NYPD. Hey, you Chinese? 
N no, I'm Japanese. Nada Nihonjin Deska. I don't know. <laughs> I probably mispronounced that really, really bad, but. Oh, yes. Can you speak Japanese? Shiro Dakane Dara Desuka. I am Kanhiko Meida. Or a Japanese. Hey, if you can't speak the language, go back to your own country. <laughs> Indeed. Deport them. Deport them back, back to Japan. You don't deserve to be here. You, uh... Calm down. Take it easy, man. It's bad for your heart. Uh, oh, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm getting, I'm, uh, I'm getting hot. Help. Uh, oh, oh, no. He's spontaneously combusting as well? Oh, my gosh. I guess it's now or never. Was the Japanese man responsible for that? Was he involved somehow? Spontaneous human combustion. I believe that's correct. Mr. M Meta. Possible. I, it's hard to say if he was involved in that at all. Interesting. Where is she now? Where? Like a hospital lobby, it looks like. Hospital? Oh, there he is. Ah, you're finally awake. Who are you? I'm Kenhiko Meida. I'm a scientist from Japan. He found you. Ah. Daniel. There's no one out there but cops. It's a ghost town. Never seen anything like it. Pretty creepy if you ask me. Where's Eve? What happened to the people in Central Park? Ben was okay, but... The rest of the audience, well, they just disappeared. Disappeared? You mean they weren't ignited? They were melted into slime and became one big mass. Hmm. That's something new. Nothing like that happened in Japan. Japan? A similar incident occurred several years ago in Japan. Although it wasn't as grandiose in scale as this one. What? Hey, give us the details. Oh, he knows something. It all started when a scientist's wife was involved in a car accident. The scientist tried... Uh, well, how's it... First of all, how's he speaking like perfect English now? The scientist tried to puncture her liver cells in order to keep her alive. The scientist named those cells Eve. Eve? The liver cells... Multiplied, and her mitochondria eventually took over her physical body. After acquiring the scientist's sperm, she, Eve tried to give birth to an ultimate being. Ultimate being? What kind of being? She, the being who mutated from the liver cells, wouldn't maintain her body for long. By the way, before the car accident occurred, the wife had registered to have her organs donated. After the accident, her kidneys were transplanted into a young girl. And Eve implanted a fertilized egg in the young girl who gave birth to an ultimate being. I was extremely interested in this and went to the lab so that I could continue research. 
After hearing about this incident, I had to fly. I had to fly over here. What the hell's going on here? I wish I could explain more. Oh yeah, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I thought that monster had gotten a hold of you, though it was too thought it was too late. When I felt Eve, something inside of me felt like it was being you felt you were about to be ignited, right? No, she no, she's well she's the only one that isn't affected. What? I I don't understand. I I think I may be a monster like her. What what are you saying, Aya? I don't know. What if what if I end up killing you? Oh, shut up. You know that's not Please, Daniel. I don't know. I just don't know anymore. Please go away. Just, just stay away from me. Hey, yeah. Uh... Please. Yes, I understand your point. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Even if I am a monster, I don't ever want to kill you, Daniel, please. I could never forgive myself if I killed you. Hey, uh, you're not a monster. You're my best partner, Aya Brea. I'll be by your side, always Aya. Now I'm gonna go out here and neglect my son some more. Oh, darn it. That feeling. Was it Maya? But Maya died in the car crash with Mom. No, it can't be. It couldn't be. Okay, so... We'll be on day three. Selection, so... That, that was actually a long part. A very, very long part. Yes, it was. Let's go ahead and save it. Okay. The next time, we're going to begin day three of Parasite Eve. So, I will see you then.